Hey guys, it's Licky Giraffe here playing Dark Souls. Welcome to part four of my uh, my current run through. Uh, should have been watching the previous ones. Um, I kind of started this playthrough pretty late on through my current run. So I'm actually, uh, well, it's only part four. I'm in Tomb of the Giants, which is a pretty end game area. But uh, in any case, let's carry on and uh, see how we do. So, Tomb of the Giants. Who's this guy? You look reasonably safe. What are you doing in the catacombs? No? There's a fine stash. I found it first. But, in any case, have a look. <laughs> oh my god, uh, what a douche. That well, I've only done it once before. So I guess we're just gonna have to go with it. Your new hope, I need be careful. They were once who would let the rings be treasured. Your new hope, I need be Kill those guys, you know. Your bounty pains me to I am certain of thank you here. Cool. Alrighty, let's continue on. Do, 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 do. And so if you're wondering where I got the Sunlight so magazine, and I'm wearing the headpiece, the light on it. It was in Lost Ziliads. I picked that up. And I prefer to use the Skull Lantern, because obviously, if I use the Skull Lantern, I have to, I have to say, not use my shield. Which I would really not prefer. So this is better. So I can just put it on my head, and then I can just uh, keep using all my weapons. So that's why I prefer you definitely use the Sunlight Magazine with the Skull Lantern. Uh, I remember first time I did this, I didn't really like this area that much. I thought it was a bit crap. So we yeah. um. So forgive me if this area is a little well, this video, or should I say, is a little boring to watch. Just let me just try to mainly focus on where am I and where am I going. Okay, very cool. Oh, well, I did you please. You know what I mean. You and me. Well, for heaven's sake, there's still a. <laughs> I don't know what's back 
here. a little risky. Pickle skeletons. Boom. Uh, ooh. Cool. Blacksmith ember. Sweet. Alrighty, it's cool. I will now continue on. Jeez, <laughs> pretty poor by me. I also don't hate those dog things. They're really annoying. Never liked them at all. Here, so I've got a little more room. but I'm so far failing to do so. Ah, there we go, finally. <laughs> oh, that's satisfying. Really annoying bug, eh? 
No, this guy's so satisfying when you kill this guy. Skeletons explode, it's just a bit weird, really. Okay, we'll go down here into the darkness. And a lot of white titan really good stuff. Pretty useful. Dark things are always fine is to try and get behind them with the attacks. They love very frontal attacks. And they're really strong, but if you just kind of get behind them, you, know, you have loads of time to just hit them in the back. And usually, you kill them without taking any damage. Usually. <laughs> Pretty sure I am going the right way. But I'm uh, probably sure I'm sure I'm probably missing like some treasures and stuff. Don't really care that much. I'm just gonna focus on getting to the next bonfire. Next the next checkpoint and pretty much going from there. That's what I want to do. Tag doesn't kill them outright, at least with that tiny sliver of health. So irritating. Of course, but what I do have is I have done this already, and I do remember this part. <laughs> I definitely remember dying at this part.
careful now. Try not to die. Ah, oh, jeez, come on. I'm getting really unlucky in this part. But, you know. Hey ho! Oh, jeez. Hmm. I'm pretty sure I should have kind of a bonfire by now. So whatever I was doing, I must must have missed it, which kind of sucks. This is literally the boss fight for Great Ornito. Okay, so I definitely have missed the pot fire. Uh, this is a pain in the ass. Um, okay, now I've got my occult weapon. I've got my sword. Can I have anything else? Um, oh, well, I suppose I'll just go for it. <laughs> Must immediately take ass this last game. <laughs> folks. <laughs> So uh, join me for that one then. See how if I can do a little better against uh, Grave Lord Nito. And yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Talk to you soon.